everyone, today I will be showing you how to get the red lip, um, how to get the perfect red lip, well I think, how to get a perfect red lip. Um, it is my first time doing kind of um, how to's kind of, um, for a long long time I have been wanting to do them but I am a tad nervous so um, I've had a few requests and some of the girls I know go you have to do it and it's just me trying to like build my confidence pretty much so yeah so I'm going to go through what you need and then you'll see the clip after this on how I did my red lip so first of all you need a red lipstick you can use whatever you want red lipstick red lacquer whatever you want I personally use um, the Chanel 75 um, in dragon and it's, it's like like a lip lacquer it's a lipstick but it's consistency of like a lip gloss. It's pretty much a liquid lipstick. So, got that one. Now, I tend, for my skin tone, it's so hard to, um, red lipsticks don't suit everybody. But because red lipsticks don't suit everybody, it's because of, the, because of um, depends what undertones the lipstick has. This has a blue undertone, so it kind of, it goes with me. But if I have a, lip, um, a red lipstick that has an orange undertone, that's a big no-no for me. It just washes me out and just makes me look like pretty much a hooker. So, um, red lipsticks for me for un blue undertones works best for me. You also need um, lip balm. I just use the EOS lip balm. Looks like this. Just I use that um, just to prep my lips because I do have dry lips. So I do that one. You also need a lip liner. Uh, any red lip liner, it doesn't matter. Um, this one is MAC in Cherry, um, which is just like your, your deep red. So I've got that one. You also need, of course, a lip brush. Now, I actually love this lip brush. It's from Silk Green Line, and I absolutely love it, and I actually want to pick up some more. It's not your typical lip brush. It's kind of like flat if you can see there it's kind of like flat which I absolutely love that it's more precise and it, you get more product on the on the lip brush you also need some concealer like again doesn't matter what concealer this is this concealer I use just for tidy ups around the lip area anything like that so um concealer and then you also need of course a concealer brush which is just my MAC 195 concealer it's okay, it's not perfect, um, it's pretty dense, so I use that. So now I will continue with how to do my red lip. Okay, Biddy, so I've already applied my lip balm, which is just, the, like I said before, the EOS. Applied that. Now, first off, I am going to line my lips. Now, with a red lipstick, it is best to, um, with any lipstick, it's best to um, actually um, line your lips. Just so you don't get it outside your lip area. And it also makes your lipstick last longer. So, I'm just going to go ahead and line my lips. Which, I have a mirror here. So. Now it's okay if you get lip liner inside your lip because we're just going to go over it anyway, so. And then of course in my bottom. And then we're just going to go and fill in the lips.
Okay, so that is done. Okie dokie, so I'll put that one back on. And then we are going to get our lipstick and a lip brush. And what I'm just going to do is just apply the lipstick, lip lacquer, whatever you want to use onto the, the brush. And I am just going to apply it to my lips. Now you can do as many layers as you like, it's completely up to you, um, just after each layer just blot with a piece of tissue and then reapply. And also the best way to um, to use a lip brush is because you're kind of layering the lipstick instead of just getting it and just whacking it on so you've got a, you know a thick layer this is like a nice thin layer If you get it on your fingers, don't go wiping your face because it is going to get everywhere. Um, so, so that is okay for me. I don't have a tissue with me because I actually forgot to get a tissue. But I'm just going to do that that layer just there. So I'll just put my lid back on. And then if you want like a precise kind of nice clean edge to your lips, you then apply. Um, concealer. I've got the Makeup Forever Concealer and you can use whatever concealer you like and I just go ahead and just clean up the edges. So what I do is I just apply it to my brush and then I kind of warm it up on the back of my hand because this is a very thick um, concealer. And I'll just go ahead and just clean up the areas. Another like concealer brush. Just even it out. And it looks like that. And also, I forgot to add because I am. A silly dilly, um, just a highlight. If you want to put a highlight on your cupid's bow, just grab a highlighter. I have been using, um, what's this one? Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer, and I will just go ahead and apply that. Like so. And I am. Done. So, looks like this. Um, pretty much it. So, comment below, thumbs up. Let me know how I did. That was kind of like my first kind of how to. I'm a bit nervous, but you know, it's fine. Um, practice makes perfect. So, I'll see you all real soon. Bye.